Hello everyone. Today we are going to learn about a very important part of speech and that is noun. So let's begin with this. So what exactly the term noun is? So what is noun? So that is all you can see. All you can see or all you can feel. All you can feel or it is all you can think that will be considered as noun okay so now let's talk about certain words here example ricky the name of a child then it will be paper which can be felt in hand then it can be sadness so all these are examples of noun let's categorize it more briefly let's categorize like you can see the following things so what you can see you can see a taxi or you can see a banana or you can see a mouse or a mango so all these things are noun. now let's understand what you can feel see how we are categorizing noun into certain categories so the concept gets more easier so what you can feel you can feel the air you can feel the pain you can feel uh, the happiness oops my camera okay not an issue okay getting back to the topic we have seen what you can see what you can feel but now let's get more categorized to certain things okay let's move ahead so you can think now what you can think now what you can think you can think about life you can think about your future fortune or you can think about the psychology right so this all is nothing but the noun what we have said the definition that all you can see or feel or think now what will be the common definition of noun the common definition of noun will be the common definition i repeat the common definition of noun is naming word a noun is a naming word repeat after me dear children a noun is a naming word so this was the short introduction about noun let's look at the kinds of noun i'm doing here kinds of noun okay so we have different kinds of noun and there are in five nouns how many are there there are five types of noun i repeat there are five types of noun and the first one is the common noun the first one is the common noun the second one is the proper noun The third one is collective. The third one is the collective noun. First one is common. The second one is proper. And the third one is collective noun. The fourth one is the material noun. The material noun. And the fifth one is the abstract. The fifth one is the abstract noun okay so we have discussed about the noun that noun is all you can see feel or think or in our common definition of noun we have seen a noun is a naming word now when it comes to types we have seen five types of noun and these are the common noun the proper noun collective noun then it's the material noun and the abstract noun that's all for today. Thank you.